welcome back to my channel and if you're new hey what's up my name is Tanya and thank you all so much for joining in and watching this video this video shout out goes to Pinkalicious Pinkalicious oh my god Pinkalicious Shabby I can I can't I can't I can't say it and my husband is over in the other room and I'm sure he's making fun of me silently as I was trying to say it and I'm like as soon as I saw that name I'm like oh my god Pinkalicious and I can say it but then when I try to say Pinkalicious Shabby I can't do it <laughs> But, oh my goodness, I love your name. Not only because of the Pinkalicious, because that must mean that you are a pink girl. And oh my goodness, pink is the best color in the world. If this wasn't about to be a video on lip swatching, since I have a neutral, my version of a neutral eye. I know it's a glam eye, but my version, I'd have a hot pink lip on right now. But I'm about to swatch five lips, so my lips are bare. But already we are like besties because of our love for pink. And then you also have Shabby as your second name, and she's one of my bestie fawns on the channel. So there's like an instant love affair happening. I just had to let you know. And thank you so much for hitting that subscribe button. I know that you said you're a new subby. That truly means so much to me. Nikki Tritt will be on the bandwagon welcoming you with open arms as will others. Everybody in this community will so love you. I know this already. So please be active in the comments and you are going to make so many friends. This channel really is truly a special, special channel. To me, it's unlike any other that at least I've come across the way friendships are formed and they're like legitimate true friendships. It's really awesome. So welcome to the Fawn family, Fawn squad, Fawn community. It is so amazing to have a new Fawn. Now this video is on, it's like Ciate is just, they keep releasing bomb products one after the other and I'm such a Ciate fan. You guys know they're cruelty free. So whenever they release something, mama's on it. I was just behind in getting the glitter ones up for you because I was in LA when they got delivered. But Ciate released liquid liquid chrome. Apparently I just can't speak today. <laughs> now these got delivered yesterday so I am a little bit late on getting them up but my parents are visiting for the week so I'm trying to like squeeze in videos in between visits and I just couldn't get one in yesterday. So I picked up three shades of these new liquid chromes and these look, I mean, first of all, can we take a moment for this holographic packaging? Isn't that just, <laughs> so it is a high shine duo chrome gloss, a comfortable non-sticky formula and a rich metallic finish. Stick this gloss across lips for an instant high coverage duo chrome finish. And then it also says, take lip color, and remember they spell it with the U because they are a UK based brand and I am Canadian, so go you. <laughs> and it says, sorry, take lip color to new dimensions with Ciate London's liquid chrome. Color shifting, shade flipping duochrome pigments have been added to high shine gloss for a t an attention grabbing pout that's out of this world. Now I just finished reviewing their, their crazy glitter ones, the glitter flip, and they are serious magic. Like, you put them on, I will insert a card if YouTube lets me, if YouTube doesn't, I will try my hardest to put the video link down below. If I forget, you guys get on my butt and let me know, I'm sorry about allergies, let me know that I forgot, but it's a more recent video and it's seriously, 
I messed up on the first shade and then the second and the third shade I managed to get in and like get it right with the, how you're supposed to do it and they are magic. I then picked up backup shades for myself. I bought my stepdaughters a shade each. My mom then wanted one so I gave her one. My stepgirls now each want another shade. I purchased them each another shade. I purchased myself two more shades. So after I put these three babies on to show you what these are like. I will do these ones as well so you can see what these two shades look like and I will try to remember to link the other video so you can see what the original three shades look like that I picked up. All right now let's get into these because I'm so excited. <coughs> My throat is still really dry. So this shade is called Zodiac. Oh my gosh this is fun. Even the lid is holographic. Like you can literally, and the rim, you literally see the rainbow. Like they actually made it holographic. They didn't like fake holographic us. So I guess let's start with, I lost it already. <laughs> Zodiac. <laughs> I will do a hand swatch. Ooh, that feels super creamy. Like so creamy. So that's what it looks like just on bare skin. My lips are bare too. These are probably going to be amazing toppers for over lipstick. I realized you got, oh, these smell good. I have a hair here and no, it's not growing from my face. <laughs> Guys, these are so hydrating. They're not fully opaque, but they're pretty damn opaque. And um, they are so comfortable. I can't even tell you the level of moisturization. Like you feel like you're doing a lip treatment. It is unbelievable how comfortable, how it's like, it's not sticky at all. Oh, it just, it literally feels like a type of a balm that you would put on your lips because they're so chapped, but you're getting like color shifting. So if you wanted it to be opaque, I mean, I would just put you know, lipstick on underneath and then top it with this and you would be golden. Wow, I really like it. Yeah, if you want more of a payoff, I would just do that. All right, I will wipe this off and on to the next. Next up we have Nova. Oh, wow, that's like a liquid molten chrome gold copper. I get, there are so many tones happening in this one. I don't even know. Oh, this one is very opaque. Smells, oh, it smells so good. Like these smell amazing. Yeah, this is totally opaque. I'm so in love with this one too, you guys. Just as comfortable, moisturizing. It's not sticky, it's not heavy. It smells delicious, like I wanna eat it. So here's the different shifts. And this is so And my eyes running again, please excuse that. Oh, I love this one. All right, on to the last of the liquid chromes. All right, the last shade is called Luna. Oh, Luna! This reminds me of Glitter is my crack. 
Is this a shade that you will love? I don't know. It's a light baby, like almost a ballerina chrome pink. I know that this would complement a lot of the eye looks that you do, though, based on your Instagram photos. This is beautiful. And Grandma Janet. <laughs> This one isn't fully opaque. This one's definitely going to be a beautiful lip topper or just a little added something something. All right, so the same problem I had with the glitter, why can I not remember what in the world? It is glitter flip. After buying three, I went and bought two more shades plus all the additional for like my step girls and my mom. I am now going to have to go see the other shades that they have because this formula, how it smells, how it feels, mm. oh my god, this one's so pretty. Okay, here's the sh different shifts. I think this is my favorite. I cannot get over the comfort level. This is awesome. Okay, I'm gonna take this off. I'll get here, last little for these guys. And then if you anybody wants to stick around to see the remaining two shades that I picked up for the glitter flip, I have Forbidden and Fortune now, which I did not have before. And then I'll apply those. All right, we are going to start with Fortune. This is beautiful purple. This is so going to be fall vibes. That is gorgeous. Ah! Have my timer ready to go once it's applied. I'm going to start the timer because now I'm just kind of fussing with it. I guess it doesn't really need to be perfect anyway. It's going to just come right off for the next color. So in case you guys missed my first video with these ones, you put them on your, sorry, you put it on your lips and it just has a matte, you know, finish to it. I know I messed up there and I was going to fix it with the Q-tip. And after 60 seconds, you then purse your lips together. You don't do it before that point. I did it before that point with the first shade, and that's why I messed it up. And then all of this glitter just magically appears like this sparkle, but it's the prettiest sparkle. You don't feel the sparkle. It's just the silver sparkle, and it's been universal with the other three. It's always been a silver sparkle. And then you can keep pursing your lips together more and more. There we go. To have more glitter. So, here we go. Oh, this one's not a great one. Because the glitter is there, but the product separated. That's sad. It didn't happen with the other shades. Okay. Purples are really hard to do, though. And these are a fairly comfortable liquid lip, too. All right, let me get this one off and then we'll test out the last one. 
All right, the last color is called Forbidden. This looks like a really nice deep red berry color. Oh yeah, this looks like a really nice color. So let's see how she performs. Okay, let's start the timer. Okay, timer's going. This is such a beautiful fall, bampy, berry. I know it's not perfect, but I'm taking it right off anyway after this. But this is such a beautiful, like, just your, your fall, winter, deep berry color. Like, it's really perfection. And that's the two shades now that they have dried down. We have 20 seconds to go. I just, see, you did not have it. I don't know if that's going to affect it. I have to redo it now. You're just so habitual to like put, put your lips together. Okay. Let's see. I'm getting crazy glitter, but look how these two dark shades keep breaking up. And the glitter is there. I need to try another coat and see if we can, if it, if we can fix it with the second layer on the dark shades. Because dark shades are really hard to perfect. Okay, timer's going again. No? No, the glitter works, but that happens. So the first three shades I picked up were complete wins. The other two dark ones, you'd have to deal with the patchiness or reapplying on the inside just to have it darker on the inside and then all of the glitter on the outside because even the second coat doesn't do it. So now I'm happy I at least picked up the other two so you guys are aware that this is what happens with the two dark shades. But I still really like them, so I'm going to keep them because the shades are beautiful and I'm okay touching up and having like the darkness on the inside and the sparkle on the outside. That doesn't bother me at all anyway. But that does it for this video. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Please share it. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, good night, good morning, wherever you are. I love you guys so much and I will talk to you later. Bye, guys.